You can use forms to collect textual information that you don't want to include on your drawing. Here I'm in the website and I'm going to pick forms. I'm going to create a new one and I'm presented with, I can change the name here, and I'm going to accept that and then I'm going to start adding some fields for data that I want to collect. I'm going to start with a section, rename that, I'm going to add a single line of text, I can change what's displayed in it, and a paragraph for address, and so on and so forth. I can add some information about perhaps job information. Basically, you can build up a form in any way that makes sense to you and your business. Add here is a drop down, so this can be a fixed set of options that so you always get the same answers because they can only pick from one or more options in the drop down. Add photos that you can take and add those photos while on site and a date, and then I'm going to go ahead and save it. Now I'm going to switch over to the app and use it. So I go to forms at the top here and Click on it, and there it is. I come in and give a name. So at this point, I'm accessing that form template I just created, but now it's going to be related to or associated with this particular drawing. And at the top left corner, I can just save it, and there it is. Now the last part, I'm going to come back to the website to download it. I'm going to pick the project it's in, open up that drawing, and right here is a tab for forms. There's the one I just did, and I can export in a variety of formats.